Okay, guys. Today, I have a sniper for you. This is my first video, so if the lighting is bad, just tell me in the comments, and I'll try and fix that up for you guys. But, this is my sniper. It is called the 50 Cal SVU. It is a bullpup configurated sniper that actually, for the, for the, um, the clip, or magazine, it actually is a chain, and each one of these pieces that clips onto another one is a bolt. So, for the bolt, when you push up and pull it back, one gets pulled up and up in there. Then it turns into a cylinder that is around this long, around like three inches probably, and it has a silver ball on the end that turns into like a spearhead. Okay. So let's talk about the reloading. It is very long, but it it got that because um it has a very it's it has a very long clip. And it has around one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two shots. For a sniper, that's a lot of shots for a sniper. I mean, for Black Ops 2, that one, it does have like 40 rounds, but this will do it better, I'm pretty sure. So the reloading, you take off the whole magwell, pretty much. Pretty weird. But, um, you just snap that off after. Throw it on the ground, and then you got the new one, and you strip it down through. Like that. And then, uh, whoop. It'll work. And then you just snap it in right there. And you got it. And then. Then. Just put it right back on. Okay? Now, let's talk about the handle. How I got the shape and form of it. So. Oh, this is a perfect angle. Okay. Um. So, how I got. Here. Let's look in the detail. I don't really have much detail in there except some slow bricks that go up and then up. And like they're down, you know. And stuff. And then basically with these whole piece these pieces right here that have the holes in them, I use these pins and then I put more hole pieces in the grip. So I just I s attached both of those and slapped it right on. So then it looked very nice and it was got a certain angle to it. Now with the trigger guard, it was very actually complicated. Here. I use this. It has like this thing. Here. Those. You had to use those. And then they had studs on them. So then I could attach this. And the reason why it's blue is because I really like that color. <laughs> and then I got, and it really looks good with the gray. Let me just clip that right up down here. I will introduce my my Father. dog, my dad, <laughs> my mom, and my two, and my older sister, my little sister, and my little brother. And my trout on the wall. He got that at Swallow Falls, which yep. is really awesome. So, yeah. Okay, now let's talk about the scope and the details of it. This might be a long video for just the Lego room, but it's my first video, so I kind of like making it long. Okay, so the scope is very, very detailed, in my opinion. Okay. So, let's turn around on the other side. It has more detail. So these are the knobs that make it, like, make it a certain distance to have it. And it's very cool. All that I used for the back was a tire. And in the tire, it had these little holes, like, rectangle little holes. And then I, I was able to stick Lego bricks in there. And then I stuck a tire in between, like, as you can see, if you can, it's, like, right there. And then I stuck some rubber bands so it wasn't all flimsy. And it gives you more cool like, detail. So that's really all I have for the, um, the scope. 
but there is a piece that I do stick on the top. I will show you that at the end. Okay. So let's get on to the working features. Okay, that one. How the hell? Whoops, the trigger guard. Just fell apart accidentally. I put some pressure on it. Okay. <laughs> now let's talk about up here. Now there is some good things. You got that rail guard. That was my bad, but that I'm filming with. So you got this long rail guard for like laser sights. And then on some snipers, there's like a red dot on the side. So you like, so you don't want to use this scope at really close to range. You just flip it over to the side, and then on the side, you have that boom, and then you just it. So, that's in Modern Warfare 3 on this one mission that I did in complete like two minutes, but it was awesome. So, and for more detail, I got this sling mount right here. If you can see the hole, it would, the felt would go right through it. So, the working feature is this bolt it goes up and then back and then up and then back. So, you know. Now let's talk about the barrel. It is very detailed, in my opinion. And even I even made it so it could have a little hole in it. Here, let me back up. So it could have a little hole in it, as you can see right there. Okay. So that's basically it. But there is this thing that I call an um primer. It's on the side. It's this. So you pull it back. Say if the bolt was stuck like that and you couldn't push it up you just push the unprimer up so you just go and it pull this right up it just go and stuff so that's basically it guys uh yeah it did take me like at first it wasn't all smooth on the top with all these bricks and I actually as you can see, there's only that one stud right there. I made that for more detail. Say it was in an actual battle before. Or a war. Make it like, you know, cool. Thing. But, yeah. I mean, that's basically it. Tell me what you think in the comments of this gun. So tell me what you think it should be next. But I really like making my own guns up and, like, randomizing it. Sorry, I had to pick up. But, yeah. I just do like it. Please subscribe and like and do whatever you can to support my channel. Um, it's my first video. So, I want to tell you a little bit about myself. Let's put the gun down for a little bit. Okay, so my name is Connor Ayers, as my channel name is. I wish I could call it something else. I would call it, like, I don't know. I, it would take some time. But for my other channel, if I do have one, it would be a gaming one, and it would be FaZe Conjuron. Even though that I'm not in FaZe, it would be cool to still have that logo on my account. But Conjuron, that is my actual username on my PS3. I'm getting a PS4 soon, but for now, I'm just going to stick with the PS3 because I'm very used to it, and my parents don't have that much money to spend on a PS4 or another game console. So... I am nine years old. It is yeah, I'm nine. I will probably have this channel up for around I'll try and keep it up for at least three years maybe. <laughs> That's um a lot of days and months and weeks and hours and days, weeks and then hours and then minutes and then seconds and then milliseconds and then yeah. But that's just a lot of time to keep up with my channel. I will try and have a video every day without editing because I, I don't know how to edit that much so yeah <laughs> I have a little I have some siblings tablet yeah hi Justin <laughs> okay it is actually currently right now it is 9.37 so we'll probably be up at like 12 because it takes so long to like upload it Say hi, Emma. <laughs> hey, can I have a kiss? No? Okay, okay. She just woke up. But, yeah. If you want me to do a room tour next, I will do that. But I kind of need to pick my room a little bit. <laughs> um, shout out to my best friend Jackson and some classmates. Like, 
Katie, Ellie, um, Logan Talk, Logan, Wyatt, Isaac, Reagan, Kira, Sophia, John, Miss Hazelwood, Miss Boyard, but, yeah. So, I'm gonna clear it up now. Thanks for watching. This is Connor Ace. Please subscribe. Um, um, like and comment, whatever you can. And I got my trunk shirt on. I got this shirt and stuff. And tell me if you want to see my dog. She is a red Siberian husky. We just got her like last year, and she's now like one year old. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Um, I hope you liked it. I like. I hope you liked it, though. It. I really like it. It took me. It took about my estimate. Of how many pieces is 237. Not that I counted. Actually, it, actually, my estimate is 250. It's just, it took me around three hours to build. Yeah, that's how much time I put in my friends. But, yeah. And by the way, another thing about myself is I am a basketball player. Oh my god, Dad. You feel weird. You feel weird. Oh my god. This boy's the baddest fucking Lego gun building some bitch you ever gonna see. <laughs> Stop regular for a second. Hi, this is my son Connor Owners. He is actually a marksman, a snarksman, a smart ass, and a zip popper. <laughs> okay. Um, let's clear it up. Please subscribe, comment, like I've already said this. Goodbye. That was my dad. And see ya. Bye.